As far as Volkswagen is concerned, this is a case of, honey, I shrunk the Golf. Fair enough, though, there is something of its bigger brother about the Polo. But is it another class leader from the company? There's a wide range of engines in the Polo, but our favourite is the 1.4-litre petrol unit. It's pleasantly torquey and makes for a genuinely satisfying drive. You might be tempted by a diesel, but with the emphasis on economy rather than performance, they're not as drivable. The Polo is generally comfortable, but bumps can bounce it around a bit, and there's a fair amount of body lean through bends. Throw in an imprecise gear shift and sluggish steering, which weights up inconsistently at speed, and the result is that the Polo is much less fun than a Ford Fiesta. There's little wind or road noise, but the engines are a mixed bunch. Although the 1.4 is pretty quiet, the smaller petrol engines can clatter and the diesel units are even worse. Few super minis can rival the Polo's cabin. The dashboard is a doddle to use, thanks to clearly labelled instruments, large dials and buttons, and a well-ordered console, while every model has an impressively upmarket feel. There's a massive range of adjustment for the driver's seat and steering wheel, while visibility is excellent. The airy cabin has plenty of room for four, and the boot has a false floor that can be removed to create a surprisingly deep hold. S models are too basic, but Moda trim adds alloy wheels, electric rear windows and an MP3-compatible stereo. You need dearer still Moda AC to get aircon, while SE and SEL models have upgraded upholstery and trim. The Polo may be a premium product, but it's not expensive to buy or run. Emissions are low, fuel economy is high, and its list price actually undercuts many mainstream rivals. What's more, no Super Mini has a better image, which means the Polo has some of the best resale values in its class. Despite their reputation, Volkswagens have a so-so reliability record. But more reassuringly, all Polos have six airbags and stability control as standard, with curtain airbags optional. What's more, this new model has scored five stars in Euro NCAP crash tests, while deadlocks, a visible vehicle identification number and security etched parts take care of any security worries. The Polo isn't as much fun as some rivals, but few are as desirable or as classy. It's roomy too, comes with loads of safety kits and should hold its value well. There's little wonder, it's our Super Mini of the Year.